Well, there's some way to open the installment. <laughs> Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Danganronpa Trigger Happy Havoc. We're going over the deaths of our previous friends, just like at the end of the last installment. Leon killed Sayaka. Monokuma killed Junko. Then Leon got executed. Then Mondo killed Chihiro. And then he got executed. Hifumi killed Taka, then Celeste killed Hifumi. Then she got executed. By the way, one thing I want to throw in here that really just tickled me from last installment, you know how some characters have just little audio bits when they say something that may or may not be directly what they're saying? Like, Byakuya will sometimes just have that little stop talking bit when you hear something from him. I got a kick out of Celeste when she started to crack during the trial. Oh, yeah. You little bitch. It like, <laughs> just really amused me. <laughs> she did it twice. And that brings us up to now. The next morning in the dining hall, the day after Celeste's case. So now there's only five of us here. Yeah, but there are there are seven people in total. Yeah. So there's Aoi, Sakura, Kyoko, Hiro, and Makoto. Hiro, all voiced by you. And then Makoto, oh. Byakuya, and Toko, voiced by me. And then, of course, you get Monokuma. So you have four of the outstanding students, I have two, and then you I know what... Uh, oh, four of the outstanding yeah, students Yeah, and then you, have, you always have Monokuma, and I always have Makoto. You still have, um... Uh... Alter Ego, too, whenever that shows oh, that's, up. Oh, that's a good point. All right. <sighs> Only a third of the number of people we started with. Seven is almost half of the amount of people we started with. <laughs> <laughs> Seven out of 15, buddy? Well, well, Indeed. five is... Because there's, oh, I mean, five of the people in the room. Didn't, okay, yeah, okay, in the room, fair yeah. enough. Loneliness has become commonplace. Yeah, I didn't really get a good look at the people in here, but I bet that Toko and Byaki are the ones who yeah, are they're not, not here. here yeah. hmm. That's true. Still. Yeah, that was weird. What did I see yesterday? I don't understand. Even though she basically exposited the whole yeah. thing. Sakura is the mastermind spy? Can that really be true? With that glowing blue eye? Makoto, are you okay? Uh, no, I'm fine. I can't bring it up in front of the others. Yeah, that is tactful. Mm. So, you're the spy, huh? <laughs> like, in front of everybody. Honestly, she would probably be okay, would be pretty honest with she you. She probably would, but like, yeah. don't. Yeah. yeah. If I did that, it would just confuse everyone that much more. That's yeah. a good point, too. Yeah. Oh, he says something smart. Yeah, yeah, finally. I guess we're a little or above average today. Smart. Yeah. Okay. Okay, in that case, let's eat till we pass out. Hmm? What do you mean, in that case? Yeah, in what case? Are you okay, Makoto? Yes. Uh, oh, in that case, let's just eat. Cause, I mean... Well, because look how scary everyone looks. It's got to be because you're all fighting on empty stomachs, right? If you fill your belly, I'm sure you'll all cheer up. So let's eat. Okay. Let's fry up some fish and donuts and eat till we can't stand up. Because fish and donuts go together. Yeah. That's like a deep impact style meteor impact. Extinction level... Event combination of foods! What? Those are both breakfast time top sellers! That's a good point, actually, but yeah. it's still ridiculous. <laughs> still, the till we can't stand up part is a problem. After we're done, we need to go explore. I see. That's right. Since the class trial is over, new areas should have opened up. Yeah, I'm curious as to what uh, commodities we have now. Or is it amenities? I think it's amenities. Amenities. It's true. Commodities or items. Yeah, things, yeah. yeah. Plus, we still have Alter Ego. We don't have to give in to despair just yet. Um, shut up. Yeah, Where actually, are we? <laughs> that's a good point. <laughs> We're in the dining hall, not the, the bath, or the, uh, yeah. the, what was, was it the bath? The bath, the locker yeah, room. the bath, yeah. She's right, we have to plan ahead and think about the future. You got it! Yeah, yeah. Think happy thoughts. No deadly thoughts. Deathy or thoughts? Not, not deadly thoughts. Deathy? Death deathy. That's really deathy? weird. Yeah. Not deathy thoughts. You know? Like when we were gonna get out of here, right? Of course, according to Monokuma, it's when one person's gonna get yeah. out of here. Dark. The serious. When this is all over, I think I wanna get reborn for serious. Or, I mean, reborn as someone serious. Yeah, and I like how his audio was like, for serious. Yeah. Well... 
Hey, are you okay? That sounds like something someone who's about to die would say. Yeah, I mean, pretty, uh, pretty compassionate for someone who was really, really out to get him just yeah. one chapter ago. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. I'm totally okay. I'm not gonna die. Why? Because there aren't gonna be any more murders. Um... Huh? What makes you so sure? According to the spirits... <laughs> I predicted it last night. Since it revealed itself to me from the ether, there's no doubt about it. However... How accurate <sighs> is your fortune telling anyway? Yeah, you didn't predict that you <laughs> wouldn't buy a piece of crap crystal wall. How about that? I can usually hit 20 or 30% on a good day. So basically... He's like, just anybody's guess. Yeah, but I think he mentions maybe in this dialogue that that's actually pretty good compared to most. I mean, fair enough. Yeah. yeah. Hmm. That seems really low. It's not like some occult. Mystery. Well, yeah, it's not like it's ESP or whatever. Of course, I'm only I'm only gonna get it right sometimes. The occult is bullcrap. <laughs> I told you, <laughs> my fortune telling isn't some occultist occult thing. So, um... Fortune telling isn't occult. You got it all wrong! Of course not! Clairvoyance is clairvoyance. Don't put it in the same category as cattle mutilation. That is an interesting way of comparing the two. Huh? Cattle what? So... He's referring to the urban legend where aliens abduct cows and dissect them as part of their research. You know, like in Majora's Mask, out of nowhere. <laughs> Actually... No. You're calling it an urban legend? As a matter of fact, it's true. As a matter of fact, it's happened to me. Oh my god, he's Randy Quaid from Independence Day. <laughs> hmm. It all happened one day when I when I went to go get a hamburger. It was a place I'd never been before. They claimed their patties were 100% all beef. It's a little redundant, but yeah. all right. So I got a burger to go and headed home. But and before long, <laughs> would the aliens like abduct his burger? Cause that'd be amazing. The end is nigh. The sky was filled with a mysterious blinding light! <laughs> no way! <laughs> and locked onto the hamburger! And as soon as the beam touched it, the burger started floating in midair! This is stupid as hell! <laughs> and then, still floating there, the entire burger started coming apart! The lettuce said the bread just fell to the ground and the beef patty just went up into the light. It was gone forever. One part of it just vanished! Yes! The rest fell back into my hand! Do you realize what that means? It means the burger oh, for God's sake. 100% beef! It must have had some pork or something mixed in. Something like 70% pork and 30% beef would be my guess. That is quite the difference I, they, I, if they pushed 100%. But, but I like how he's guessing like the percentages of how much is yeah. pork and how much is beef. You can't trick me. Uh, so I stormed back into the burger place and got up in the manager's grill. That would hurt. Yeah. It's pretty hot. <laughs> And they totally admitted it. That's oh, could you imagine? He come. How would you know? Funny story. <laughs> it wasn't 100% beef. They totally mixed in ground pork with it. This is an amazing story. How about that? Now do you see? That is cattle mutilation. That's fantastic. I kind of got lost halfway through. I can't tell if you're for the occult or against it. You stink of stupidity. Ouch. Don't be mean! I stink of... How dare you! Wait, how dare you? That was a question! Well, it's asking, how could you dare to do that? <laughs> well, you do stink, though. Hmm. That's fine. <laughs> That's fine? It killed the music. <laughs> uh, um, <laughs> anyway, I hope your prediction turns out to be true. <laughs> well, at the very least, I won't murder anyone. I can't wait till there's only three people left, so he'll be 20 or 30% right about him not murdering anyone. Yeah! Me either. I mean, I would never. Of course. Me either. Indeed. Nor I. Now, Kyoko's got the grammar thing going on. Where were you on that one, Sakura <laughs> Howie? That goes for me too, of course. I could never kill any of my friends. Or Byakuya. <laughs> I felt like those words of encouragement were helping us come together as one. After so much sacrifice and hardship, we'd finally become united. But... Well... To be honest, I wish Byakuya and Toko were here for this, too. Yeah, I want to hear Toko promise not to kill anyone. Well, she... But... Everyone would know it's her. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. But they're so hard to deal with. They only think about themselves. Actually, no, Actually, that, 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 is, that, that is a legitimate twist. Toko could kill someone, not Genocide Jack. 
you don't know how Toka would kill somebody. True, <laughs> but uh, I don't. But what I was saying is that's not necessarily true. Byakuya thinks about himself. Toko only thinks about Byakuya. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're better off without him, I say. Someone should probably just kill him. That was enough to prove we were united for the time being, but within that bond, hid weakness and fragility. Again, kill Byakuya and Toko, and then we'll be set. We, 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 we like, friendship bond of steel over here. There'll be two people left, though, unless you can oh, one good person point. to kill I'll... the two of them. Then... Yeah, one person kills twice. All-star apologies. Who are you people? Chihiro and Aoi? Chihiro Aoi? and Aoi, yeah. Usually, they don't have... They have something to do with it, but if you look... There aren't any people who were... Yeah. We began our search as soon as we'd finished our breakfast in the dining hall. We had to find out what had opened up. What was waiting for us. Ooh. Let's go looking. Stare time. Is that a beautiful singing voice? I know. I'm so pro. Wait a minute. We, we, we still can't use those stairs, right? Correct. Okay. That's like the very end. Yeah. But you didn't know about the other second floor. Oh! Oh, whoops. Went too far. Map. Use it. <laughs> That's the best part, is that I am. But I'm also looking at like the, like the wall and stuff like that. Alright, up to Daisy. I think this is just a linear floor. Oh no, the next floor was a linear one. But the fourth floor stairs were right near, I think. Oh uh, no, wow, they were farther yeah, away than second, I thought. Yeah, it's the second floor. They're... Oh yeah, you have to do a whole loop around. Yeah. Alright. Well, I am curious. And this time, instead of going to the gray physics lab, we'll... Okay. We'll head up to the fourth floor. Oh, cool. Hey, it's not, like, single color. I mean, I guess it kind of is, but there's, like, a grating for the floor. So now we have access to the fourth floor of Hope's Peak Academy. Maybe this time we'll find some kind of clue. No. This time I have to... F or I is it have to find Yeah, I wasn't sure, because I's always capitalized, yeah. so how do I... This time I have to find it. Yeah, speaking of which, we did... I forgot to mention this, but we did go looking for clues last time, and then someone KO'd us from behind. Could it have been Kyoko herself, or was it really some mysterious assailant? Oh, yeah. This is the girl's bathroom. Pretty obvious just by looking at it. There's no reason for... No good reason for me to go in. I do like how he specifies good reason, because if there's evidence... Nothing. Not even the plating. Nope. Well, I guess we're done. I don't. Have we ever seen that before? Alright, that's the fourth floor. Yeah, done. Guys, <laughs> see you later. Hey, wait a minute. Is that another item shop? No. Oh, no, the yen is the item shop. Okay. Piano hell, yeah! I'm saving that one for last. Alright, so... What's this? Rattle, rattle. No good, the door's locked. I guess we won't be getting in here. According to the nameplate, this is called the data center. But what's behind the door is a total mystery. I think it's data. <laughs> Uh, alright, so which rooms. means we cannot go into the Monokuma room from mm -hmm. there. Yeah, two classrooms which probably look about the same, with different wallpaper. One day I saw Monokuma class, what the... In class. La 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 la, gobble gobble, freaking inane. So Yasuhiro is just up here. Clock right there, but what use is time in here? Monitor again. Being scared of it won't do any good, ignore it, get a coin from it. 219 coins, I forgot how uh, much we got. This is just the exit. And yeah. then... Oh, and just a tip too. Camera on plates. Um, yes? If you are going for achievements... Don't think we'll get used to it. We'll get used to be watching 24-7. Don't spend too many coins just to spend coins. Because there's an achievement for having 999 coins. Oh, I forgot. Even an ultimate hero, ultimate can't destroy this plate unless they had ultimate superhero powers. Well, that's a different thing to say. Alright, hero, what's up, my man? I'm glad this floor got opened up and all, but there's like a ton of locked rooms up here. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> no problem. Good thing this room isn't locked. Uh, Alright, next classroom. I totally didn't predict this, man. Yeah. Oh, wow, look at this crazy wallpaper. Monokuma from the school score. Store? store I'm Monokuma from the school store. I'm very kind. Gather up your coins and come play with me, or I might die of loneliness. God damn it, Monokuma. It looks like there's nothing to see here. Just the same sort of stuff. 
Oh, there's that other both just in the yeah. place. All right. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did I miss something? No. Oh, no, it just shifted from yellow to red. Yeah. Because I came out and it was just, that really threw me. Oh, man, that is like, like Suspiria levels of red. That is like... Fifth floor. Almost turning your eyes red. Yeah, fifth floor. Can't go there. Damn, I love that. Two people, as always then. Inside the room, the smell of medicine was oppressive. So this is the chem lab. I hope inhaling all this stuff doesn't do permanent damage. Well, maybe it won't if you waft. It's a remarkably big shelf, and it's stocked with all kinds of medicine. That's right. Ah, listen, Makoto, listen. Just take a deep breath and calm down and listen to me. Uh, okay, Hina, just chill out. <gasps> There's all kinds of stuff we didn't have before. Vitamins, minerals, amino acids, creatine. What's creatine? Uh, something that athletes eat. I don't remember exactly what it is. <laughs> all right. And what? They even have protein zyme X. Is that going to be relevant to the plot? I have no idea. W what's that? Hey. Jeez. A high quality protein drink. It's nothing like that cheap swill in the warehouse. <laughs> it's connoisseur level. The cheap swill. God damn. Oh, yeah? This is amazing! It's a gold mine! Ah, my prayers have finally been answered! You know that's a big deal considering we already got the pool. Mm hmm. Time to load up some more prayers then! Oh. A gold mine, huh? Alright, let's actually talk to them. Hina and Sakura seem to be lost in a deep but friendly conversation. I need to find out what's going on with Sakura and the Mastermind, but I can't while hey, she's with Hina. Huh? You need something? N no it's nothing. You sure? Okay then. And Sakura will probably say something similar. Sakura's lost in conversation with Hina. Need to find out what's going on with Sakura. Da -da -da. What is it Makoto? Did you need something? No, nothing. So, really? Well, okay. And there's nothing else? Nope. Yeah, okay. Chem lab. That's some chem lab, by the way. Mm-hmm. Alright, so this is the, the stairs we can't go to, so there's, I guess, three rooms left. Oh, that's on the fifth floor, I guess. There's a room that I didn't yeah, remember, what room it, what, didn't remember where it was. Computer lab? Looks like it. No, but Oh, look, another picture. This is the, the office. office. But of course there's no hint of Are any teachers. Are they selling paper? Yeah, Dunder Mifflin. Of course there's no hint of any teachers that we'd normally be able to rely on. Oh yeah, I see the photo. Whoa! Alright, I'm saving photo for last. There's a flower on the desk. Somehow it makes things feel that much weirder. Uh, alright. Are these all just observations of the flowers? I kinda hope not. I don't think they are. That's the same. And it's another coin, too. Yeah, there's three different flowers I can check. All of which have coins. Yeah, it looks like there's nothing here but the flowers and this mysterious photo. Huh? There's a picture on the floor. This picture. God, this is weird. What? Celeste, Hifumi, and Sayaka? The smiling faces of three people who are dead now. A classroom without metal plates over the windows. It's exactly the same. It's just like that picture I saw before. Strange that Sayako's appearance was delayed for this picture. Mm. There's no way this isn't important somehow. They're smiling the way you'd expect any normal teenager to smile. Except Celeste is messing with Fumi, I guess. Just a normal group of high schoolers living a normal school life. I can't possibly believe they were able to smile like that in a world of despair like this. So does that mean this picture was taken before they ever came to Hope's Peak? Which would mean everyone in the picture knew each other before they got here? Including Sayaka? No, there's no way! Monokuma did it. It must be fake. Ha! <laughs> You're fake! Your face is fake! Monokuma popped out of nowhere and snatched the picture from my hand. <laughs> a forgery plot? What are you, a middle schooler? You think the moon landing was fake too? Come on! Nice! Then you're saying the picture is real? Hey, um, 
If there were such a thing as the Nobel Truth Prize, I'd take first, second, and fourth place. Fourth? <laughs> Too bad. Actually, that's probably not true. I asked you a question. Is this picture real or is it a fake? Hmm. Oh, Makoto, you're so eager to split things in half, aren't you? Ooh. So part of the picture was doctored? Hey, uh -huh. um... But it's no use. It's just no use. Mudara. If you try to split something you can't split, that can't be split, you'll end up feeling like you're the one being split. It's true. The picture is real. No more, no less. <laughs> Splitting hair, I think. Oh. Uh... Ho ho ho! Without another word, Monokuma disappeared. So the picture is real? It's really real? If that's true, if that's the case, if that's the case what? If that's the case what? Damn you! Please play Danganronpa 2. Yeah. <laughs> that's the end of the game. Uh. The nameplate on the door says Headmaster's Room. On the fifth floor? What a pain in the ass. Fourth floor. Oh yeah. The Headmaster's Room. There must be something worthwhile in there. And rattle, locked. rattle. Huh? There's the a snake locked. in there. Rattle, it's a rattle snake. Oh god, yeah. <laughs> Damn it! Alright, no headmaster's room, so music room. I look forward to that one. But the picture of a piano. So let I me chime it. in. Oh. Not yet, it's not just. I like how here is it that like, all the room, almost all the rooms are locked. Whoa. Or something like that, there's only two locked rooms. Yeah, this is the music room. It's hardly even a classroom, it's more like an actual concert hall. Again, the fourth floor. This school doesn't really make sense. Yeah, it sure doesn't. What's that? Oh, the camera. Let's take a look at the piano forte. Is this a grand piano? It seems really old. I bet it's worth a lot of money. Of course, without someone around who can play it, it's totally useless. You know, you haven't told me what you think yet. What I think? So... About the secret room in the boys' bathroom. Uh, memory's a little fuzzy. Yeah. Ah! Well, um, I did find the secret room, but as soon as I started looking around, I was attacked. What? Attacked? By who? By whom? Well, they came from behind, and I didn't have any time to they react. They took me from behind. What? An attack from behind? And I didn't have any time to react, so I didn't see who it was. And when I came to, the mountains of files and documents were all gone. I'm sorry, I know how important those were. That's fine. It's okay, I already saw the ones I, need, I needed to in there. Hi. And I half suspected the mastermind might come after you. Wow, thanks, Kyoko. <laughs> <laughs> what? Because... When I discovered the room, the mastermind must have seen me on the surveillance camera in the hallway. They must have seen me go into the boys' bathroom and not come out again. Still, I wanted you to go and see it. I wanted you to see how the Mastermind would react. I wanted to see how the Mastermind would react. Essentially, I wanted to find out if the Mastermind actually knew about that room. Well, he does now, dick! It would seem... But to attack you and steal everything in the room... That must mean there was some unknown clue in there that could reveal the Mastermind's identity. Then you knew I was gonna get attacked? That doesn't matter. You can handle that kind of thing, right? After all, you're a boy. Yeah, but I don't know, man. Mono That's very sexist. Yeah, but no, I'm like screw like... this game. <laughs> Let's play this cancel. But like Mondo punched me once, and I literally went off my feet yeah. across the room. Like I don't know, man. So You've far, hardened up since then. No, the the thing is, so far I've been attacked twice. Did I recover? Yeah, but I was knocked unconscious with a single punch both times. Like Kyoko, for God's sake. What does she think a boy is? Y yeah, like. Fine, I understand. I mean, I have very slight brain damage, but I understand. Then let me ask you something else. Do you know about the note that was left in there? The note that said, you must not leave? Just a second. We shouldn't talk about that. Not here. Kyoko stole a quick glance at the surveillance camera. So... I'm looking into it. If I find any, if I find any out anything, I'll let you know. Listen to me. Is that okay? She made it sound like she was asking, but it was clear I wouldn't have any say in the matter. So then. So now it's your turn. Let's hear your secret. Huh? 
<laughs> I went to bed till I was ten. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I forgot about that one. There was the oh, I was just I was just reading fairy tale and there was one like that something like the thing like if I beat you in battle, you'll tell me your real name and it's like no, I won't go for that. What's your thing? If, well, if I tell you, if you win, I'll tell you my, my secret. And the other guy wins. So he's like, what's your secret? It's like, and he, you just look at his feet. He's like, I lost my other sock. And I don't know where it is when he had a sock around. Like, his, so stupid. You know, like, <laughs> and the guy just points to his sock. He's like, oh, I've been looking for yeah. you all this time. Solved. <laughs> That's yeah. my secret is I can't find my other sock. So dumb. <laughs> Did you think I wouldn't notice? You're hiding something. Am I wrong? Th that's... Th that that picture what? of uh, Sokka reminded me of the action figure of the Amazon from Dragon. Oh yeah, uh, Dragon's called. Crown. Dragon's Crown. Yeah. It's like, do not do not mess with her. It, she looked okay in the game, but when you actually make a figure out of it, it's like, where are the muscle? Like, yeah, the bodies don't look aren't shaped like that. Yeah, it's like '90s drawing. <laughs> What's the matter? If you're worried about the camera, why not just write it down? Uh, um. Well. Or we could not talk about it here, like you just said about your uh, Yeah, right? Hey. We're friends, so you should be able to trust me. Isn't that what you said before? You want to not manipulate me, friend? You're right that there shouldn't be any secrets between friends, but there's nothing worse than expressing doubt about your friend when you don't have evidence for it. Ooh, wow, this is legitimately... I don't I don't know if it's an actual... I'm gonna do it, though. I, I, I don't think it's a branch in the storyline. I think it's... Whenever you do one... Just see what it's happens gonna, choose Yeah. Them. I haven't found conclusive evidence yet. If I talk about it now, it could just make things that much worse. Friends shouldn't keep secrets, but there's nothing worse than expressing doubt about your fro. Oh. <laughs> See if you can keep saying tell. <laughs> yeah. S sorry, I can't tell you. Not yet. Correct. So, that's your answer? However. But do you think that's fair? You were happy to hear what I had to say, but now you're unwilling to share? I'm sorry, I really am. That's fine. That's fine. Goodbye. Goodbye. Ooh, awkward. <laughs> With those as her parting words, Kyoko left me standing there alone. Ooh. Oh well. I think I made her mad. <laughs> That's fine, it's never good. I've already taken and, and a good look at things around here. The thing is too, I mean, obviously she had more more of a concrete secret than you I, do. I could have just said but, that. But yeah, but her secret was like such an important part of like finding clues out and you're yeah. just like not it, it, it could be but yeah. still and well, you well soccer is the mastermind is important or where he's working with mastermind at least or yeah. something oh, yeah, but, working, um, working with that man too, yeah. but then but Kyoko trusted like kind of trust well I guess not she set you up in a way yeah but still, I don't know there's a lot to think about but for now I should head back to the dining hall and talk to the others this is a really quick look around to the next floor the other ones took forever no kidding <laughs>